Good morning to our dear shareholders and the rest of our audience watching online. Thank you for joining Alliance Global's 2023 Stockholders Meeting. While we have yet another virtual format for our event, we are in high spirits as we build on the upbeat energy of the year before. We have seen sustained improvements in AGI's financial and operating performance in 2022, even as we continue to hurdle the impact of the pandemic and the global economic geopolitical challenges the whole of last year. Our consolidated revenues increased by 20% year on year to a record level of 183.6 billion pesos. With pre-minority income of 25.2 billion, an increase of 6% year on year. Attributable profit amounted to 16.1 billion pesos, which should reflect a growth of 7% year on year based on core earnings or excluding one-off items in 2021. Our strong showing mirrored the achievements of our companies, most of which have already achieved their pre-pandemic operating results. Meanwhile, AGI's consolidated debt stock as of end 2022, amounted to 214 billion pesos. This was lower by 1 billion from our end 2021 level of 215 billion, bringing consolidated gross debt to equity lower to 58% from 64% in end 2021, while net debt to equity also declined to 32% from 36% in end 2021. AGI's diversified portfolio allowed the company to sustain its recovery in 2022, a testament to the strength of our brand equity and the effectiveness of our business strategies, both complemented by our solid financial position. Its real estate arm, Megaworld, is the country's biggest township developer, with 30 townships in its development portfolio spanning over 5,000 hectares throughout the country. In 2022, Megaworld achieved close to 90% of its pre-pandemic top line as consolidated revenues went up by 17% year-on-year to 59.5 billion pesos. Meanwhile, attributable net income amounted to 13.5 billion pesos. However, Without the tax adjustment in 2021 due to the CREATE law, its core earnings should show an increase of 19% year-on-year. Emperador continued to barrel through 2022 with another record performance. Its consolidated revenues went up by 12% year-on-year to 62.8 billion pesos with brandy sales up 9% to 40.7 billion, while its whiskey sales grew by 18% to 22.1 billion pesos, bringing its attributable net income to 10.1 billion. Emperador is the proud owner of the finest single malt scotch whiskey brands under White and Mackay as well as the premium Spanish brandy products under Fundador. These brands, which have gained popularity across the globe, have encouraged the group's premiumization strategy in the Philippine spirits market. Its luxury single malt whiskey, the Dalmor, houses some of its finest collections of rare and exclusive single malt whiskeys in its flagship store in Uptown Bonifacio in Taguig City. Whiskey lovers have exclusive use of the private den, tastings with our whiskey experts, and invitations to exclusive bottle releases. In 2022, Emperador opened Asia's first and largest outdoor whiskey park in one of Megaworld's townships in Taguig City, McKinley West. This destination brings a whole new whiskey experience to patrons through curated selection of whiskey products and concoctions along with a wide array of food choices, games, and entertainment that can all be enjoyed in an open-air setting. Golden Arches Development Corporation 
the exclusive master franchise owner of McDonald's in the Philippines in partnership with AGI for its quick service restaurant business continued to record a sequential growth in sales and profit in 2022. It broke a new record level in system-wide sales which amounted to 61.1 billion pesos as same-store sales growth accelerated to 31% by end 2022. Its strong performance was driven by its commitment to its strategies that include providing value for money offers, driving menu excitement with limited time product offers, and elevating the omni-channel customer experience with its next-gen stores. McDonald's strong performance in 2022 was also reinforced by the increase of mobility and consumer spending. Attributable profit of 1.8 billion pesos already reflects close to pre-pandemic levels despite various cost pressures during the year. As one of the biggest employers in the country, McDonald's Philippines believes that everyone has the opportunity to grow and succeed in the company, emphasizing the impact of job security. It is the first quick service restaurant in the country to practice a direct hiring policy and provides regular employment to all its crew members in the country. The company hired more than 17,000 new employees in support of its new store openings, employing working students regardless of race, religion, gender, or sexual orientation. McDonald's Philippines ended the year with 704 stores after it opened 45 new stores last year, with more set to open in 2023. Right across the year, Manila's premier gateway airport is the Newport World Resorts, the country's first integrated resort owned by AGI's leisure and entertainment subsidiary, Travelers International. The property hosts the biggest concentration of five-star hotels in one area, offering a total of 3,900 room keys. Five world-renowned international hotels and two homegrown Megaworld hotels, plus the Marriott Grand Ballroom, the biggest venue for the country's mice operations. Travelers turned the corner in 2022 and posted a profit of 1.1 billion pesos as it achieved record levels in gross gaming revenues at 31.8 billion pesos. Mass gross gaming revenues more than doubled together with the sustained improvement in its VIP operations. Moreover, its non-gaming operations recovered sharply, driven by increased staycations and mice activities in the Newport World Resort Complex. As we fully recover from the impact of the pandemic and sustain the forward growth of our domestic and international operations, AGI is allocating 70 billion pesos for this year's capex, reflecting a 23% year-on-year increase from the 57 billion pesos we spent the year before. AGI is also positioned as the biggest player in the country's tourism sector, considered as the low-hanging fruit for the Philippine economy. It currently has the biggest hospitality portfolio across the country, spanning 7,500 room keys. Just outside Metro Manila, AGI through Megaworld is also developing a mountain resort gateway called Twin Lakes on a 1,200 hectare property overlooking the picturesque Taal Volcano within the Taal Lake. The project is European inspired, featuring the Twin Lakes Hotel, various residential projects situated on rolling terrain as well as a strip mall that has become a popular venue for people who visit Tagaytay. In the Visayas region, the group owns a 150-hectare property in the country's most popular beach resort island, Boracay. 
The Boracay New Coast has three hotels, premium residential village and condominiums, commercial and retail strip, a convention center, and the multi-awarded 80-hectare fairways and blue water golf course. In Laguna, AGI has a 300-hectare property called the Hamptons Caliraya, a sprawling lakeside township that allows residents to construct their own homes with built-in docking areas along the famed Lake Caliraya. The township will also offer a charming clubhouse and a private marina where residents can dock their boats and enjoy water sports facilities and activities. The group is also now developing Paragua Coast Town, an eco-tourism community on a 462-hectare beach property in San Vicente, Palawan, which boasts the country's longest coastline that is also Southeast Asia's second longest. The township will have facilities that encourage a holistic lifestyle, including health and wellness sanctuaries, a cultural center, and a mangrove reserve park. On the sustainability front, AGI reiterates its strong support to all of the 17 UN Sustainable Development Goals. As part of Megaworld's efforts to maximize greenery in its townships and contribute to its carbon offset, it uses endemic trees and seeks to achieve a 40% ratio of green and open space in its new development projects while preserving century-old trees within its townships. Travelers also embarked on its urban farm, one of the priority projects under its I Love Earth Integrated Sustainable Program. Its urban farm project aims to promote sustainable sourcing of fresh, locally grown vegetables. Last year, Newport World Resorts collaborated with Malaysia's Boom Grow to launch the first Boom Grow machine farm outside of Malaysia. The technology uses 95% less land, 95% less water, and 95% less fuel to produce clean greens that would otherwise have been imported. The produce is now being used by Marriott's Manhole Restaurant and other dining outlets in the property. McDonald's Philippines is planting the seeds to a green future for the good of the planet through its green and good initiative. Every McDonald's green and good store is equipped with utility efficient solutions such as solar rooftop and lampposts and rainwater harvesting tanks. Green building solutions like 25% recycled steel, eco pavers and panels, as well as concrete fibers were also used in its construction. Meanwhile, sustainable packaging, proper waste disposal, and active mobility continue to be part of its upcycling and inclusive dining experiences. Emperador's operations in Spain through Grupo Emperador highlight the sustainable and eco-friendly process it implements. From the vineyard to the bottling process, always looking for the optimum final result. This includes monitored humidity and salinity sensors, intelligent irrigation systems that optimize the oxygenation of water use as well as its more efficient use, aerial drones for more streamlined vineyard supervision, and the use of the falcon for pest control, an ancient art. In these ways, Emperador combines traditional methods with the latest technological advancements to create a perfect ecological synergy that is reflected in the quality of all its products. Over the years, AGI has been focused on delivering products and services that create a bespoke and premium lifestyle for our discerning customers. A firm believer of the country's attractive long-term growth and prospects, the group is betting on the continued improvement in consumer spending. This puts AGI at the vantage position 
to elevate the taste and preference of Filipino consumers and customers worldwide with its aspirational product offerings, further reinforcing its position as the country's truly premium lifestyle conglomerate. Thank you.